This video is my first attempt ever and I dedicate it to the memory of Andrei Tarkovsky, the great Russian film director who died in December 86. I'm now going to read a small part from my dissertation about Tarkovsky. In Stalker, the protagonist has allotted himself the task of being a guide to two men on a hazardous journey, reminiscent of Hesse's journey to the east, through a perilous zone, at the end of which <coughs> is a mysterious room in which, in a ruined building, where the dreams of their heart's desire will be fulfilled. The men are forced to confront themselves and realise how pitiful their desires are and therefore they sit outside the room in despair, unable to enter. On their return, Stalker is reunited with his wife and child. The wife is very emotional and begs him not to take anyone else there again because it's too dangerous, but he is dedicated to finding a man who will wish for peace on earth. She offers to go herself and make the right wish, but he insists that he must go on taking men through the zone. Tarkovsky seemed to be saying that the devotion of the woman's love helped the stalker to continue in his quest, but that he knew that it was the heart of man that must be changed from greed to selfless love. Tarkovsky was and is for me the greatest poet in the cinema and he did the most beautiful films that I've ever seen. And they're like, for me, a kind of living painting, and I wish to God he wasn't dead, because I'd love to have met him. He's the only artist who's ever really inspired me, except Balfour, and has kept me going at Kingston Polytechnic, where I've just finished a BA in fine art and I feel as disillusioned with art schools as I was before I went there actually. But Tarkovsky has kept me going and Mikey, my personal tutor, told me about because she said my photographs reminded me, hit her of him. And I went as soon as I could to see Nostalgia which was showing and it was wonderful and I've been to see it a second time and I'll go. And I'd love to see it again. I can never get enough of Tarkovsky.